Look at him throw that net. Yeah, we're catching bait right now. You got him? Yeah, we got a few. Oh yeah, we got a few right here. Look at that, boy. Oh Lord. Right here, folks. Folks, today I'm over here with my friend, Friday Leatherwood at Pickwick, below Wilson Dam. Morning, y'all. Going into early fall right now, and that's the best time to get over here and try to catch some of these fish out here on Tennessee River. Hey, in this lake right here, you got smallmouth, big old catfish, you got spotted bass, big large mouth, whatever. We just fishing. Ain't no telling what we're gonna catch neither. Appreciate y'all tuning in. I'm Rocky Drake, Rocky Drake Outdoors. We're gonna catch some fish. <laughs> When I get to where I'm going to fish, I turn off all my electronics, especially if I'm smallmouth fishing. I, I don't, I don't use anything. I, you know, you're looking for particular spots. You're looking for current breaks. You're looking for eddies. You're looking for anything that reflect the current. And, you know, I fished over here for going on 50 years, and I kind of know where the stuff's at. But, but it's important that that uh, that your electronics is not on. I think. Now, why is that? Now I look at it. I, they can hear the pinging. I, they get used to it. They get so accustomed to people using the live sonar and all that and man that thing really puts off a beat so you're saying it puts pings yeah, down and yeah, bounces it puts, oh yeah and those fish can pick up oh on yeah it. that yeah yeah they do wow they do oh here go here go here oh 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 oh, 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 oh. oh lord i got hey he, he jerked he, he like to jerk it in son he's on here he okay let's see now oh my god he's up under the boat he's a good one too where is he Ronnie, you might need to get the net on this. Oh, Lord, yes. Oh, yeah, look, look, he go jump. Oh, oh my gosh, no. Large Big large mouth, a giant, giant large mouth. Yeah. <laughs> look at y'all, he pulling dry. <laughs> yes, sir. Look at him. He jumped like a big small mouth. <laughs> Man, I can't hardly do nothing with him in this current. Oh, Lord. Look Mine's at that right there. Now. What I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. That's a good solid fish right there. <laughs> That's what started <laughs> off today. <laughs> yeah, we just got here, y'all. <laughs> He I mean, he like jerked this rod out of my hand when he hit. That wasn't no playing around with us. Here it comes, Ronnie. Hold on. Get him, Ronnie. Get him. Get him. Got him. Got him. Oh, yes. <laughs> Look at that. Just got here at Pickwick with Ronnie Leatherwood. It's the first fish, big fish we caught today. Ain't going to be the last in this. I'm going to turn it loose now. Yeah. I'll show them where you caught that fish. Okay. I'm going to show y'all right here. We're fishing this bluff down through here like this right here. Down through here. See, when you get right here, you see how it's got a little cut back in there like that? Well, it's got a little point comes out right here. Well, that little point just comes on out in here in deeper water. You got him, Ronnie? Yeah. Ronnie got one. Wait just a minute. It's small. It's well, small. you sure? No. Ronnie got one. Yes. Yeah, what is it? <laughs> a little spot. Oh, a little spotted bass. Look at that. Well, hey, they're going to buy it today, ain't they? Yeah. Well, anyway, what I was saying, folks, right here, uh, got this little point coming out right here. And anytime you have a little point sticking out in the river like this, as you come around it, there's going to be a little eddy behind it. You can see right here, see, you got a little nook right there. It comes out like this right here, and you got a little nook right back in there. So I always target those areas right there when you're fishing these bluffs. And the reason I know this, I learned it from Ronnie Leatherwood. <laughs> Good job, man. That's a nice fish. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Let's stick another minute back on and do it again. If you got a minute and ain't got no wiggle in it, you ain't gonna catch nothing on it. So you wanna make sure you keep a fresh, lively minna on your hook. Can y'all see that minna down in there? See how he's swimming around? Look at that, see him flashing. See, every time that minna does out there, it puts vibes out. And these fish, that's what they key in on. It's like a distress vibe that those minnows put out. Now folks, most time there's two ways you can fish these minnows over here down these bluffs. One of them is free lining like Ronnie likes to fish. And the other one is put a little split shot on like I like to fish and bounce the bottom. Free line, free line is just basically a hook with no weight. It's like that right, like there. That right there and see where he got smushed. He sure did. <laughs> Another thing too, you don't get hung up near as much. Not near as much. No, you don't. Yeah. You don't. I get hung up a lot more yeah. than Ronnie does. Yeah. <laughs> That's the first uh, good fish I've caught on this new rod I got right here. This rod right here is an Ardent. Ronnie actually gave it to me and it's a Tournament Pro. Of course, I ain't no Tournament Pro, man. And uh, this one here is seven foot and it is a medium heavy. That's what it did, medium heavy. Nice, nice rod here. Oh, and this brand new reel I got right here, look here, boy. It's an Arbogosia Revo. 
the reason I got that for fishing over here, a lot of times these smallmouth, when you said, when they grab that minnow, a lot of times they'll run up under this boat before you can ever catch up with them. This thing's got like nine to one, if I ain't mistaken, ratio. So every crank you make, I mean, it, buddy, it comes, it comes back to the boat quick. So I've hooked smallmouth up there against that bluff and can't catch up with them. They'll run under the boat and actually jump over here on the backside of the boat. And you don't want that because it's hard to get them in after they do that. So I got me one of these fast reeling up rails. Ronnie, maybe we can get him on one of these days. <laughs> Need to throw as close to that bluff as you can without hitting the bluff with that minnow. Now we're just sitting here right now. Ronnie's got it on spot lock. It's a technique that he uses. He'll pull up to a good place and he'll spot lock it in the current and fish it. And then he'll take it off spot lock. He'll drift on down to another little area, spot lock it and fish it. It's just not a continuous drift down through here. Some folks, they'll just like, just drift, 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 drift. You know, and that's fine if that's what you want to do. But you, when you do that, you drift by a whole lot of fish that you possibly could catch if you just sit there on spot lock and just fish it a little bit more thorough. Oh, 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 one just grabbed it. Lord, how mercy one just grabbed it. Yeah, he grabbed it. Here we go, we can put the hook on him. He's still on there. Yeah, he's still on there. There he is too. Boy, get the net on this one. I promise you get the net on this one. Oh Lord, have mercy, get the net on this one. Yes, yeah, it's a good one here. If it's a small mouth. And he's fixing to jump. I think it's a big small mouth. Come on, come on. What is it? Oh yeah, big small mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about a big one. Well, good one. Oh Lordy mercy, y'all see that right there now. <laughs> oh Lord. Let me get him up here for you. Get him in there. Oh yeah, that's a nice one there. One of them long skinny ones right there. Yep. Uh, goodness, so strong. Fish been caught before. See right there where somebody else hooked him? Right there. Nice fish, probably two and a half, three pounds. I thought he's a lot bigger than that, but I was fighting him in that current right there. So anyway, I'm gonna turn him loose here. Me and Ronnie, we ain't fished over here, what, six months? Yeah. This, I mean, it's the first time we've been over here in six months. Yeah. I'm good with it, ain't you? Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Catch you a big one, Ronnie. Now when me and Ronnie first got here this morning, we didn't, uh, we didn't put a lot of bait in this tank. So we'll probably end up going back catching some more bait. If you put too much bait in one of these tanks right here, they rub up against each other and they lose a lot of scales and they won't last as long. They won't be as feisty. So, they don't, you don't want to do that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what, Ronnie? Ronnie said, uh-oh, back here, y'all. Golly, Ronnie, what happened? <laughs> Even the bluff master misses them every now and then. Goodness gracious. How'd you miss him, Ronnie? Uh-oh, uh-oh, y'all. Oh, look, 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 look. Ooh, look at my pole. See my pole? He's running with it. There he is, dude. Let's see what this one is. Nain, I'll let big. <laughs> hey, it's, a, hey, look at here. Oh, oh goodness. Folks, that was a big saga. Goodness gracious. I don't catch many. That thing would look like it's two foot long. No, it wasn't two foot, but it was, oh, Lord, big saga. I'd have put him in the live well, took him home eating him. We pulled over here at this bluff, y'all, in this shade right here. You can see the shade going right down through there. It's a good place to start around the bluff. It's kind of these little shady areas like this. I throw it up there. Hold your rod tip up and keep your line, as much of the line out of the water as possible. The more line you got in the water, the quicker it goes down through there. The current will take you back quicker. Because sometimes it'll just hit a rock down there and you'll think it's a bite, but it's really not. And sometimes you think you hit a rock and it's a bite. So what I do is I just put that line on my finger like that right there and I just pick up on it real slow like it right there. And usually if it's a fish, you can feel the weight on it and you can actually feel a little bit of vibration in your finger. And, and, and that's a fish, you can tell. So then what you do is you just flip your bell over and you reel a slack up and just set the hook. Now, if it's a rock, you'll pick up on it and you can tell, it's, it'd just be a real solid feel. It won't have no give to it, so. 
anyway, that's uh, that's that's usually what I do. Anyway, I got this one place down here. I've been slobbering to go. <laughs> and Ronnie, he's gonna take me down there to pacify me. And that wind picking up. There he is. He just pulled. Y'all see him? Oh Lord! <laughs> he just snatched up on it. He got it too. Oh, you might as well get the net. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here we go. There he is. There's a big one too. Uh, I told you, Ron. It's where we need to come. <laughs> and I don't know what it is. <laughs> Probably. I hope it ain't no drug. Well, yeah, it may be. Is it good? He pulling the drag, that's for sure. <laughs> Listen to that drag sign. Goodness, son. He's powerful. He powerful. It's a fish. It's a fish. It's a big fish. Goodness. No, it's small a big small mouth. Oh my gosh. Come over here, Ronnie. Big small mouth. Big, 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 big. Yeah. Let me make sure I got this camera. <laughs> big yeah. small mouth. Guys and fool me, y'all. I'll be honest with you. I me too. I thought it was a drum. Look at that what one. Get that big small mouth in there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> well, folks, right here's what we come to Pickwick for, right there. Beautiful small mouth bass. All right, folks, gonna turn him loose right now. And we fixed catching nothing up here. Boy, we have, oh Lord. <laughs> now we just, there we go now. Folks, we just pulled down here on this spot right here and there's a real nice fella up here. How y'all doing? Good fella right there. <laughs> He's sitting here watching us fish. He brought us some luck because we, we just pulled up here. Got that big small mouth, but oh Lord of mercy, we can catch a nut. My folks, right here is the hooks I'm using. That mosquito hook. That's just a little number two red hook right there, made by owner. And I stopped, we stopped at Perkins Tackle here in Florence. And that's the only place that I can find these hooks without having to order. If we can get out there and catch a nut, hopefully. Yeah. Right in the seam of that current right there where he's at, right next to that wall in that little shade. Right there. Let's see if there's more than one right there. There may be a whole parcel of them down in there. That fish I just caught, folks, I'm gonna tell you what. I, oh, oh, hey, he, oh Lord, nothing just got it. I think tell y'all something, but one got it now. There he is. <laughs> he's another big one. <laughs> Get the net. Oh Lord. Yeah, he good in too. He pulling good. He's what is he? Oh Lord, he pulling real good. His small mouth. Just about guarantee it is. Come right here and get him, Ronnie. If you don't care, I'll get him right over here. I mean he's pulling. Okay. Oh yeah, what is it? Small man. No small man. He, yeah. he ain't no real big one, but hey, need him anyway. Make him feel, hey, make him feel like he's a bigger. Need him, Ronnie. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Well, that makes two right here. <laughs> I'm good with him. You good with it? Oh, yeah, boy. Nice little fat one there, boy. Looks like a little football. Look at that. Nice little, pretty, pretty little, little pickwick small man. Drop him back down in and go down in there. Show you right here now. I got just I got a little split shot on right there. I got it about I don't know 18 inches above that hook right there with that minnow on it, and that's the way I'm fishing. Now Ronnie back there, he free lines. He don't <laughs> he don't use he don't use no weight most time, but now he done put one on now. <laughs> you got him, Ronnie. That's a good one, ain't it? Showing sure off good and Ronnie said, "To net, get to net." Oh, big nice big farm out. He jumped up right here at the boat. Get him up here right now, get him. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Hold that up, Ronnie, let it wood. Oh Lord. That's yeah. sure enough good and right Sure enough, flat footed good and boy. Oh Lord. All right, folks, Ronnie got him a good in here. Look here, boy. This fish will put on two pounds here in the next few weeks. Yeah, that's a long skinny one, ain't it? Yeah. Long and lanky. Sometimes that's what they are. Go back down in there, yeah. you just turn it loose. Oh yeah, we in them right here now. Oh Lord, we're about to run out of bait. So it's got this one split shot on. I don't think the current's done picked up, so it's going down through there a little bit too fast for me. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this HUD on. There he is. Okay, here we go. 
It's gonna be a big fish. No, he didn't. Big fish right here. Oh yeah. Another good one. I don't know how big he is. Get the net and make him feel like he's big anyway. What is he? Small mouth. Is it really? Yeah. Oh, that's a nice small mouth, boy. Oh Lord, that's a good one too, son. <laughs> I didn't know he was that good. Yeah. <laughs> get, get him, Ron. Yes, sir. Boy, I tell you what. Yeah. He soused down on it, I mean. Yeah. Sit down here. I got him hooked right there. See them little old bitty hooks right there? I'll tell you what, they'll, they'll, they'll hold these fish, I'm telling you. There we go. Yeah, there's a nice, another nice little small mouth. Not a big one, but a nice one. They ain't all gotta be big. They just fun to catch, that's right. Go back down in there, get big. Yep. There's another. <laughs> I ain't joking with you. He like jerked stinking rod out of my hand. Let's see if he's still on here. Let's see, I'm gonna pick it. Oh yes, yeah, look here, see him pull? Oh Lord, it's like be a monster. Let's see right there. There, yeah, it's good. Instant drag pulling. It's, he, it's near gonna jump. Oh Lord, get this definitely gonna be a netter. Def, definitely gonna be a netter. Good Lord, y'all. Big small mouth jump. Get, get, get the net. Come, come on, this thing. He gonna jump again. Oh, look at that. Oh, that nah. that pretty. Yeah, he's pretty, boy. Oh, Lord. Man, the guys are nice in there. Okay, here we go. He ain't want to give it up, is he? He's mean, mean smallmouth down here, boy. Look at that pretty thing. Hold on. Boy, get, oh, Lord, he's pulling. Get him up in the... <laughs> he jumped plumb in the net. Good one, good one. Good. Oh, Lord, don't go. Oh, yeah, he's a good one. Yep. He's a good one. Come here to me. Yeah, he's a good one. There he is. Ronnie got him too. Got Ronnie got one? You got him, Ronnie? Ronnie go. Huh? Oh, you got a big one. <laughs> I don't need the net. <laughs> Ronnie, you need the net for that? No. Oh Lord, y'all. He didn't know he wasn't big. Had a pretty good day today so far. I'm glad we come down here at this place. 16. All right, folks, there's another nice small mouth right there, boy. I mean, Ronnie's on them now, boy. Oh, Lord, gonna turn them loose. Well, folks, Ronnie right here, he been fishing this lake for 50 years. I think that's what you told 50 me. 50 years, that. yes. That's a long time to fish a lake, so he knows it better than probably anybody around here. And Ronnie, what's the best months to come and catch big small mouth over here on Pickwick, in your opinion? I tell everybody October the 15th is usually the magic date we will usually have our false first frost close to that really cools off the water it's 75 5 right now and the fish just haven't showed up in numbers we've caught a lot of fish today but it will get better i promise you and big fish big fish yes yeah. big smallmouth yeah big smallmouth this is trophy class lake right here big big fish lake goodness ronnie i thought that one was after your manor wasn't it was. is he still I on got it he got it? He got it. He got it. Get him, boy. Get him, Ronnie. What is it? Oh, big small mouth, big small mouth, big small mouth. Hold on, hold on. Ronnie, get him over here, Ronnie, get him. Good. Let's get him. <laughs> Good deal, Ronnie. That's a boy, that's a heavy fish. Yeah. Heavy fish. That's a long, lanky one. Long, skinny thing. Skinny. I'm gonna get bony. Him back in the water. Folks, appreciate y'all tuning in. We'll catch you next time. Thank you for bringing me, Ron. God bless everyone. Thank you for watching. <laughs>